is our annual elementary science and engineering fair. Wesco ISD is promoting 21st century learning. We're promoting our students to go to Mars by 2025, 2030. Our students are the ones who are going to be building the spaceships, the rockets, the boosters that are going to be sending people to Mars, and our students are going to be the astronauts going to Mars. This project was about to see if carnival games at like the stock show or any carnival game is rigged. I figured that they put like some mass in the bottles, like they either put water or they make the bottles even heavier. I'm a judge for these students. These are kids, elementary, third grade through fifth grade, uh, bring in their science fair. This is where all the mechanical, uh, robotics type of, of uh, projects are being held. So what I'm doing is I'm picking up students and judging them. Uh, if the student is here, I will sit down with them and ask them several questions. Hello, good morning. How are you today? Good, my name is Rick. What's your name? My name is Ashley. Ashley, pleasure to meet you, Ashley. Can I sit down here for a minute? I, did, I do think that I worked really hard on the project, especially since it was not a very easy project at all. It's really cool and interesting. And you can, sometimes you can have fun while working and you won't even know it. I'm really glad that the district has this science fair, so that way sometimes you can improve your science skills and your science project. I really enjoy watching the wheels turn in their minds, you know, when their eyes light up and say, uh, I did this, I did this, I didn't know this was going to happen, this, this ended up uh, as a result. It strengthens our teachers, it strengthens our students, and for myself as a science strategist, it really lets me see where our strengths are in the district, both with our students and with our staff. My message to all of our students who are here at the elementary fair is to continue with their passion, to investigate what they have found to be interesting and let that grow with them. And as long as that does grow with them, their abilities and their love for both science and academia and their own selves will grow with that.